Hi, Caitlin. Hi, Evan. So I know you like creepy, scary games. Yes. But I also know that you have a really squeamish time when it comes to like body stuff and <laughs> I do. soft, squishy things. So I'm really curious to see how you do in today's game. We're going to be playing the Mortuary Assistant. There are dead bodies. There is jump scares. There's also a few other trigger warnings, addiction, suicide, family death, and drug use. So this is a more mature game. I'm ready to start. Are you ready? I'm ready. <laughs> Let's do it. Got my heart rate monitor on here. All righty. We would have both of ours, but one of them died. So, you know, <laughs> it's just me. My wrist hurts. So Caitlin's going to be playing most of the game today. Also, I feel like I have more heart rate fluctuations. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> You're like more cool. even. Yeah, even, even, even. <laughs> even, even. All right, here we go. Where's your science robes? <laughs> I just realized this didn't play the intro. The first time I, I, I just like, I loaded up this game ahead of time just to like, you know, see if it works. And it didn't play the intro. Is there supposed to be? There's supposed to be an intro. Do we need the intro? I, I don't know. Should I try it one more time? I know this is kind of like a little bit... Uh, great start. Great start. New shift. Yeah. I'm sure it'll just... Um... Oh, great start. Great start. Great start, everyone. <laughs> I'm more panicking over technical difficulties than I am about the game. <laughs> but uh, I think just in case... Yep, it just starts here again. So you just got your degree in mortuary person okay. and you're showing up for like a shift with this guy but your grandma warned you about this place she thinks that it's cursed grandma all right here we go here we go into the cursed mortuary place Ooh. don't mind if i do oh Kalen. Making a great first impression. I'm just trying to pour it in a cup. Here. This this mor eh. morgue is cursed because you can't have coffee. Yeah. I feel very tall. Wow. Yeah, right? Right? Look how close I am. Is this how you feel walking around places? Look how close I am to that yeah. chandelier. I always have to kind of watch my head. Okay. Red steepler. I believe you have my steepler. Can I open? Ooh, yes, I can open. Okay, nothing here. Give me something. You're dressed very casually for a job as a mortuary assistant. Maybe there's like a locker room Hello? and I'm going to get changed. Wow. Did you not dress professionally? Wow, that's a creepy thing. Creepy painting. Oh, what's this? Rebecca, one last thing I forgot to give to you. Please grab a pencil from my desk and sign. Thanks, Zoe. P.S. Good luck. <laughs> Used to sign paperwork left on the door. Ready. Okay. Oh, uh, quick inventory. Access quick inventory and choose the item you wish to use. Most but not all places where items can be used will cause the use item icon to appear. Okay. Right mouse button. Oh, pencil. I can't use that here. Oh. And I got my heart rate working. Oh, it's working? Okay, can we use it? Oh, I did it. I signed it. Ooh! <gasps> A guy in his underwear. <laughs> Rebecca, great, perfect timing. I just finished with Mr. Dalton here. Please wheel him back to cold storage and bring us Mrs. Page. <laughs> My heart rate, due to all the technical difficulties, <laughs> yeah. is 93. <laughs> okay, okay, it's calming down okay. now. It's calming down now. <laughs> Moving the deceased, use the gurney by standing behind it and pressing the gurney interact key. Then walk backwards with the gurney down the hall. Okay. Ooh. 
No hands. <laughs> You're using your telepathic powers. To bring a body in or out of cold storage, open the bay with the body's name, pull out the rack with left mouse button, move the cart over to it, okay? Do you want to look up? Eh, eh. Oh, in here, okay. I'm assuming, yes, Mr. Dalton. Left mouse button to pull that out. Okay. And then go to I the gurney and press E. Can I push it? I rotate it over. Come on. Okay. It's pretty forgiving. And then I push it back in. I think you have to. Yeah, there you go. Go over to the side. Yeah. Uh. In you go. In you go. Close the door. Oh, I didn't know if I needed to get the cart out of the way. Oh, no. It goes yeah. through it. Okay. Okay. They're doing it. You need um. to get the new patient. Oh. Who's this? Dorothy Page. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Chat's warning you not to drop the corpse. <gasps> <laughs> you can drop the corpse? I don't know. They might be trolling you. Okay. It's so funny, too, because uh, we got Caitlin a new RGB keyboard that's so cheery and bright. And yet this is such a creepy game. Yeah, for me. Well, you know, it is what it is. Come here, Dorothy. Come on. Come on. Come on. I think press uh, press the gurney again. E? E on the gurney? Uh, ah, okay. And then E on the gurney again. It's weird that some things are E. Turn. 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 <laughs> it's funny because, like, I know they make the turning with the gurney difficult to simulate real life. Because if it wasn't, that'd be hilarious if you were just like swinging in the gurney around <laughs> like this. All right, I'm just finishing up something here. So why don't you grab the clipboard and start recording identifying marks? I'll get out of your way when you're done and let you hop in here. Okay, clipboard. Clipboard is used for forms and keeping track of mortuary tasks. Large item. Well, I wonder what's he looking at on that computer over there? Go, go look at him. Go Hold on, I push space bar and I'm frozen. There oh. we go. Dorothy Page, 87. Okay. Lord, I need to see what that. computer? Yeah, what's oh, he he's at? there? He's there. Oh, geez. Uh, well, how come I'm doing this, dude? You're the assistant. You're just doing all the work. Oh, he just. Oh, is he having a Windows error? <clears throat> computer locked. Hmm. It's a strange background, my dude. Very creepy. <laughs> Very creepy. Windows error. Anything in here? You can't. <clears throat> okay. Let us examine. Ooh. <coughs> Inspecting a body, hover the cursor over unique markings such as moles, scratches, bruises, and interact with them to record them to the clipboard. Okay. Oh, she has a, wait, wait back. She has something here. Yeah. Did I write it down? I think so. Rotate. How do rotate. I? Click on rotate. Oh, I just click it. No. Nothing there. Okay. How do you know when you're done? Oh. What was that? Hmm. These old windows never stay latched. The window closed. Ooh. I don't like that. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh whoa. Something. It's like, did you see the stuff leaking out of it? Ew. Like into the air? Was there like molds? Oh, sorry. You take on my mouth. I was going to close this. Oh, you have it on your screen, too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, Dragon Feeny's here. 20 months. Thank <gasps> you. Hey, Dragon Feeny. Thank you so much for the 20 months sub. Okay, let's get out of this. <laughs> oh, should we do her head? <laughs> Come on. Some Shoot people are joining right now in the middle of this, and they're like, oh, what are you playing? <laughs> uh, nothing. <laughs> Let's see, I want to get her head. Maybe I have to be here. Oh, okay. oh. 
Oh, is that a scratch? Try clicking it. Oh, yeah, I see. Wait, it was when I was clicking. <clears throat> mm. There was, like, smoke. All right, nothing there. Okay. Oh, man, the road hitting their heads is, like, so, so creepy. creepy. It makes them seem alive, but dead people aren't alive. I'm sure everything's totally fine. Is that well, yeah. something? No. It didn't register. I already and got we already that got one. that. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. This is very creepy. Yeah, it's like the silence of it, too. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. what happened there? Oh. And something on her leg yeah. right there. Great. Climb on in here and put everything into the record system. Climb? Climb on? Don't forget to what? take the printout to the front desk so Zoe can add it to the packet for the family. After that, we'll get started. Did you fix your computer, dude? Oh. Tender cadaver information. Click the record. You'll die here. What? What was that? I didn't say anything. You all right? Y yeah. I'm fine. Sorry. They said you'll die here. <gasps> I heard that. I heard that. Okay. Um... So, click the record system icon right here, or right here, to open the program, match the sections on your clipboard to the corresponding sections on the computer. Once all the findings have been entered, click submit. Okay. Name? Okay. Dorothy Page? You need to type it? Really? No, it's not letting me type. Hello. Let me try. Maybe I'm just doing it in the wrong order. It said drag, I thought, right? This looks about right for healthcare computer programs. How do you, how do you heck and do? Question. All okay. right. Match the sections on the clipboard to the corresponding sections on the computer. It just shows clicking. Yeah, back you and click forth. and then you click. Okay, head, head, head. Oh, head. okay, you got head, it. So, head. wait, stop, stop. <laughs> it's thing on the left and then the thing over here. All right, right shoulder. Hold on. Left shoulder. Oh, oh I, I. Oh, I, there's I, nothing I there. Did it. Okay. Okay. Left leg. Contusion. Oh, yeah. oh, okay. Right arm. Yeah, so you click oh. like the box first. Left arm, mild abrasion. Name, Dorothy, age, 87. Oh, okay, then submit. Head. Okay, yeah, I think that's everything. Yeah, the <sighs> only ones that are blank are right Record leg and left. keeping is difficult. I know. <laughs> You're gonna die. I know. Okay. Back. And then what did he say to do? Take it to the front desk? Yeah, it's printing out right now. Where is the printer? Is it, oh. oh, here. Okay, embalming report. Packet of the mortuary paperwork related to the handling of the deceased file up front, so they are available if requested. All right. Oh. Follow the glowing footprints. Not at all ominous. No. Okay. Hello? Right click. Oh, Embalming report. Okay. Time to embalm. Ooh, time to embalm. Ooh. That's where you replace their blood. I thought I was just All doing right. the inspection. I've set everything out so you can just go ahead and get started. I'll be monitoring. Everything's on your list there if you need it. Ooh, this makes me uncomfy. Who? What do you do? There's so many things. Where's my list? Where's it? Right click. Clipboard. Okay. Wire jaw shut with <gasps> needle injector and setting needles. <gasps> oh. Ooh. Pick up, pick up the needle injector and the setting noodle. Yeah, I'll do one thing at a time. Needle I injector. I was at setting noodles. <laughs> Put some noodles in here. Um, moisturizing wipe. Setting needles. Problems with the wire used with a needle injector. Okay. That's probably the needle injector. 
think so, or is that the needle injector? Try grabbing that one. Needle, needle injector. injector. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> uncomfy, uncomfy time. Uncomfy. Do not like. <laughs> MC Pro hosting is here too. Oh, <laughs> hi! <laughs> this Hello. is a weird game. Yup. Uh, okay, pull the manipulator up and press the injector button to drive barbs into the skull and twist the mm. wires to shut the jaw. Okay. Well, we don't want them talking ah! to us. No, don't make me do this. Oh, no. You're the you're the one who likes creepy games. Yeah, but I don't like body things. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Do I, oh. To, do I need to move it? Just keep on doing it? Ooh. Ooh. What did I walk into? A <laughs> <I> lot. <laughs> oh, okay. I just keep on okay. doing it. You just do it a few times. Ooh. 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 Okay. Oh. Go. Oof. Mm. Do not like. Nope. Uncomfy. <clears throat> okay, I'll do the next uncomfy thing. Okay. Okay. Space. Insert eye caps to keep the eyes shut. <gasps> Ooh. No. 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 Eye caps. Eye caps. Eye caps. Mm. No, thank you. No. Placing eye caps. Use the manipulator. Open the eye completely. Interact with oh, the eye. Oh, do you need place. a manipulator tool too? I open them completely and then place the eye caps and then close them. Right. Mm. You know what's weird is I like mm. learned about those recently. Eye caps is to prevent the eyes from opening? Yeah. Was it in a book? Was I listening to a podcast? I don't know. But I like, I know about those now. Mm. Mix embalming fluid and pump. So probably. can't hold anything else what oh you might can't have to put anything else down some of the stuff you're done with like the eyeball I can't box. hold anything else <gasps> hmm sometimes we get chemicals that haven't been stored properly and it can make them pop like that oh, that's just keep doing your thing i'll get it oh okay so i put the formaldehyde in there you might have to yeah get one at a time and i get this <laughs> You right click, you put that in there. Oh, did I grab it? Well, All right, there okay, we go. that aids in retaining moisture, humectant. And then formaldehyde to prevent all. polymerization. All right. Okay. We're gonna have to like plug a hose in. I mean, how do you? Make an incision in the artery oh, and the jugular artery. vein with scalpel. Oh, no. Okay, this is the part that Kaylin's going to be oh, the least no. comfy with. Oh, arteries, veins. <laughs> Kaylin really doesn't like arteries no. and veins. No, I don't. Uh. <laughs> Some items need to be used directly on the body to use an item. Open quick inventory and select item needed. Okay. Maybe you gotta go get something else. Back. Um, where's the other vein? Um, carotid artery. Where is that? Make an incision at the. Oh, okay, I did that. Use <laughs> forceps to clamp. Oh, no, you did the jugular. Oh, it checked it off. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Use forceps to clamp tubing to both veins and connect to embalming pump for <laughs> something doing this is Caitlin's like nightmare tubing forceps <clears throat> okay Caitlin you can look away if you no. really if you don't okay forceps tubing Ugh. back <clears throat> okay and dude's just like like you, you can't. You 
can't do this yourself. Why can't I get past you? I think he's like training us. Okay. Okay. So <clears throat> engage, engage the pump, pump and let the body drain. Oh! Oh! Sounds like our vacuum pump. <laughs> Can I just sit in the waiting room? <laughs> I need to use the. I need to use. The... Hello. Hello. Can I not close the bathroom door? What if I need to use the bathroom? Yeah, see, we're wearing a nice blouse. I would not wear a nice blouse to this. I don't think that she's dressed appropriately. Okay. All right. Turn off the pump, remove the tubes, close the incision. Mmm. Gross. The noises, too. Okay, I heard a check mark. Fill... An empty IV reservoir bag with cavity fluid, and then insert the trocar into the abdominal cavity. What? I'm learning too much about too I'm much. I'm learning too much. <laughs> Straight to the organs. I'm missing something. Oh. For what? Ooh, look insert, at that diagram! Insert the into the belly buttons! <laughs> <laughs> you know what else weirds me out, y'all? Belly buttons? <laughs> <laughs> Not belly buttons in general, but like touching my belly button. <laughs> <laughs> whoa, did you whoa, see? Whoa, whoa, whoa. I saw something. I saw something outside. I saw something. What was that? It just looks like a dark thing. Else. Dragon Feeny says, okay, but else. same. Right? <laughs> is, is that same on the belly button thing? It just feels weird. It feels like I'm poking. It's like too close to my organs, okay? <laughs> Legit touching belly buttons isn't right. Right? And Evan tries to poke mine. Because <laughs> you're evil. Fill and... With okay, fill empty. I think we need to fill the IV bag with the fluid. Where's the fluid? Is any of these the fluid? What about oh, the... Oh, oh, here. Oh, cavity fluid. Cavity fluid. Ooh. Ew. Okay. Oh, don't, don't, don't look, don't look, don't look. At least look, it's not look. the belly button. Oh, look, you can see it under the skin. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> but at least it's not the belly button. That would make Legit me feel Legit touching worse. belly buttons isn't right. What's so weird about it's touching weird. belly buttons? They're, you can, mm, oh. It's just, like so it. everyone has a belly button. It's I, not weird. I'm not saying having them is weird. I'm saying touching them is weird. <laughs> I'm touching mine, one, mine right now. I don't mind <laughs> touching yours, but... Don't touch mine. Can you touch yours? I can, but I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> Putting fingers in belly buttons. Yeah. Ooh. I'm go. glad I'm not alone, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Zero out of ten. <laughs> right. uh, okay. Okay. Mix cleaners in bathroom closet. Oh, tank cleaner. Tank. Then pour into the embalming pump. I guess we're cleaning the equipment now. Um... Okay, so we know where the bathroom is. Yeah. We're, we're just like... Okay, to clean embalming machines. All right. Clean our base. Okay. Now I go back, I guess, because nothing is glowing anymore. So... Yeah. I guess... And then I put it in here? Okay, yeah, the, the embalming pump. Paint Tank cleaner. cleaner. <clears throat> Maybe I need to open this. Ah. Okay. Is she going to start leaking? Uh, cleaning that. <clears throat> Ooh, we, we need to apply moisturizer to her facial features. <clears throat> How long will this take? All right, Kaylin, do you think we should leave the window open or closed? Open. All right. I want to hear what's going on. Also, fresh air. All right, it you can apply the, the moisturizer. Lotion. It rubs the lotion <laughs> on the skin. <laughs> I thought belly buttons right? were just for holding the lint from shirts. Yeah, that's that's all mine's used for. <laughs> Your belly button is very deep <laughs> also. <laughs> no, it collects a lot of lint. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> 
move the wipe across. Okay, yeah, we're just gonna do a little yeah. self care moment. A little self care, yeah. Yeah, yeah. just a little, little self care moment. Ooh, I don't like the noises that it <gasps> makes. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh. Tell you what. What? Why don't you go ahead and head out? I'll take over from here. Okay, yeah, bye. Uh, yeah. Uh, are you sure? I'm I out. I just got here. Don't worry. You're doing great. I'll get the last of your paperwork sorted today and call you in for your first shift. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <clears throat> Let me out. <laughs> <laughs> Funeral fact, we call moisturizer massage cream. It's very important as we get very dry due to the preservatives. Huh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, in chat we actually have someone who who does this. We have an artist. Really weird. So some stuff fell over. That's not a big deal. No, I know it, it wasn't even my fault, but he sent me home right after that. I'm just really worried. He was supposed to finalize my stuff today. And he said he would, right? Yeah. Is that just a microwave? So that's a good thing. In the wall. Yeah, it just it didn't feel like he meant it. Like. He just said it to get me out of the building. Uh, wait a sec, I have another call. Hello? Hey, Rebecca. It's Raymond. Oh, hi, Mr. Delver. Uh, look, if I did anything wrong today, just... No, no. Uh, I wanted to apologize. You've done a fantastic job. I'm just not feeling too well. Hmm. That's uh, actually why I'm calling. I know it's late, but we just got three new cadavers, and no one else can make it in right now. I was hoping you could come in and... Hmm. Uh, yeah. Uh, are you sure? I mean, of course. <laughs> Nervous laughter. You are doing me a huge favor. What a sad apartment. I took care of the rest of your onboarding. We're all set. Maybe she just moved in. in your personal belongings drawer in the back room. That's you great. Uh, thank you. I I'm on my way right now. I hope you feel better. Thanks again. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Holy shit. That was him. He signed me on. He needs me to come in tonight. See? I told you it was fine. Congratulations. Thanks. Congratulations. I have to go, like, right now. I'll talk to you later. It's so rainy out, though. I just want to stay home. It's cozy. Oh, don't make me leave. Uh, where are my keys? Look at that. I wonder if they just made it rainy out so they didn't need to, like, um, model the outside. They could have just used the same model they did for the, um... Are your keys in here? That's true. Wolfios. There's food. Hello? Keys. 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 Okay. Look at, look at the book. Embalm? Hold on. Temporary items. Do not take up space in your normal inventory. Okay. Hmm. Book about the history of preservation and how people used it to cope with death. Hmm. Interesting. I'm Mr. Two Shades. Yeah, and, and this is the one song radio station. Oh, it's the radio. We're going to play with this is the one song radio station. Because we're going to play the same song because it's all we have the budget for. <laughs> Sounds like something out of Rick and Morty. That's very much the energy of like, just one we sell song doors. Radio. Doors, doors, doors. Get <laughs> doors. That's all we sell. It's doors. Anyways, okay. I should stop procrastinating. <laughs> Welcome to One Song Radio, where we only have one song because <laughs> we don't have the budget for other songs. Apparently, this lady's also a cat knocking things over. Yes. Okay. Oh, it's rainy. I know. Run, 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 run. Close run, your door. Run, run. Close your car door. Fine. Yeah, be responsible. All right. Guess I'll head to the back and get started. All righty. <gasps> oh, so gaspy. Oh, I don't no, like don't that. No, don't turn that off. Mr. Delver, I need help. Someone's outside the mortuary. Just try to stay calm. I know you're scared. I'll unlock.
lock the door in a moment. What? What? This is very sudden, but listen to me. We have to start right away. What? I'm sorry. I didn't know until it made itself known this morning that it was here, let alone bound to you. What? I had no way of knowing the possession had started. What? Look, this isn't funny. Stop. You need to take this seriously. You need to act quickly. This is insane. I'll just leave. I'll just fucking leave. You can't leave, Rebecca. I, I can't allow that for you or for others. It's far too dangerous. <laughs> what am I supposed to do then? Most bodies I work with at night are fine. So we stay calm. Okay? We embalm, <gasps> file the paper. Whoa. Come on outside. Everything. Treat it like a Oh, I think it's him. Staying focused will help. I left some things on the he? desk. I'll call again when you get to the embalming room. Yeah, no, that's wait. him. That's him. Damn it. What the fuck? This is Because he put down the phone as soon as what? he hung up. Okay. This is so stupid. Just some hazing for the new girl or something. Just, just eh. play along and do your job. Okay, I need my card, I think. He said, like, get your card from the back room. Oh, it says Rebecca. Oh, okay. Old key. Oh, yeah. Tape recorder. Maybe one of those mm. key works. Really? Okay. Hold space, I wonder. Sorry. I don't have my clipboard. Hello? Oh, open up the electrical panel. Oh, man. You just know the power is going to go out at some point. Oh, oh and you're going to have to restart the breakers. Where's my card? Drawers? Do I need to, like, um, how do I pull up? Oh. No, that's not it. Uh. Oh, oh okay. smart, smart, so smart. I need to, like, actively use it. <clears throat> Uh-huh. <laughs> fucking quit it tomorrow. I mean, who does something like this? All right, listen carefully. I'm, look, I'm sorry, but this entire thing is extremely unprofessional. If this is how you treat new hires, I don't think I can work for you. This isn't funny. Rebecca, you don't have to believe me, but I hope you do before it's too late. Mm -mm -mm. The only way to save yourself is to banish the demon before you're too far gone. To do that, you will need to learn the demon's name, bind it to its chosen body, and burn it in the retort. Uh. <laughs> Look, I know this is a lot to take in. I wish I could do more for you. I had years to learn what I know. You have hours. <laughs> Why aren't you here with a us? number of cassettes to instruct you in the hope that having a physical object with a known message help you stay grounded. I won't be calling again. You can't trust the phones. Anything dun, dun, can be manipulated. Dun, 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 dun. Listen to the tapes. Learn the demon's name. Burn the correct body. The most important thing in the room is in that cabinet. Open it up. Good luck, Rebecca. I think Sorry the cabinet behind the desk. This is insane. There you go. Whatever. Just professional one, grab a body, and get started. Cassettes. Cassettes. <clears throat> one, night shift system. The night shift database. A computer program combining all my findings into one reference point. The database contains all the information Whatever. on the process Just of expulsion, grab a body, the tools used, and get started. And most importantly, all the markings of the known demonic names. If you ever forget what to do, Play these tapes or look it up in the database. Mm. The collection of demonic names is the most crucial piece to the puzzle. You will need this information. My ID card is in my personal belongings drawer. On the back is the passcode to access it. Use it. On the back? Chat's wondering if we can um, <clears throat> move our cam a little bit. Is there room to move us to the side a little bit? Oh, is there something here? Uh, apparently, we're blocking subtitles occasionally. Oh. We can move us over a smidge, but... Um, yeah. I mean, you can move us over a smidge. Which way? Which way? To the right. 
Do this a little bit? Yeah. Okay. Might help. There's a second tape. Yeah, should we... Uh, let, let, let's do them in order. Let's try to find his... Code? There's a code somewhere? Wait, a code? I missed that. Oh. Ooh. Yeah, screw all of whatever this is. I'm getting back to work. No, oh, this is where the demon stuff is. Demon stuff. That's number three. Let's do number two before number three. At every moment, okay. the oh. demon is funneling its energy through you, weakening you until you are unable to resist. Oh, so there's a time thing. A demonic entity is a delicate balance. The further you are from possession, the more time you have. <sighs> the closer you are, the more the demon will make itself known, allowing you the information to guess its name and the body it's bound to. The only way I've found to tell how far along a possession is on your own is to scribble on a piece of paper. Mm. Don't think about it. Just scribble. Look carefully. If you notice anything strange, it's starting to take hold. There's a notepad and a pencil on the desk in the front room. Checking from time to time can give an idea of how long you might have. Okay, a couple things. Yeah. Um, I think our heart rates have frozen. <laughs> people they are might have died. also wondering if we can turn the um, uh, words up. Oh, okay. Really, it's kind of low. Let's look. Um, volume. Oh, geez, they don't have volume independent of. We can try just. Let's turn all of it up. Yeah, we'll turn it up. Yeah, this isn't like a. This is. I guess this game is still a little bit early in its. Cool. Paper and pen pencil. Okay. Use an inventory. I use an inventory. Here, should we charge our things in case they died? Yeah. Okay. How do you how do you check? I grab the paper and pencil. Maybe right. it'll prompt us? Okay, I'll get these. Charge them. Did we, and we listen to all three tapes? No, there's still one more tape. Okay. Also, how do you listen to tapes again? I don't know. All right, tools of expulsion. To banish a demon to hell, it must be bound to its chosen body and burned. The three objects in this cabinet are your tools. Mm. First, the clay tablet in the center is called a mark. Placing the smaller pieces in the oh, correct geez. configuration will spell the demon's name. Second, the bottles on the top shelf are a special reagent that will react to the mark. Add a bottle to the embalming mixture during the process. Uh -huh. When the mark is placed on the correct body with the reagent inside, force the demon to become bound to it. Pay attention to signs that you have chosen correctly. They can be obvious or extremely subtle. What? Once you are certain the demon is bound to its vessel, burn it. What? Finally, the pieces of paper on the right are called letting strips. It must inscribe the sigils of its name in our world to begin the evocation. You will need to uncover these sigils to use them. Hold a letting strip up while wandering the mortuary. If it begins to smolder and burn, you're close. When the paper combusts, the sigil has been revealed somewhere in that area. They can be anywhere. So look on walls, under objects, inside furniture. Anywhere. The demon will inscribe its sigils over time to try and hide them. So check regularly. Once you uncover the sigils, Use the night shift database to decide which demon you're dealing with what? and use that knowledge to create <clears throat> the mark. The steps are simple. Add are the they? reagent to the embalming mixture. Uncover the sigils. Build the mark and place it on the body. Then, when you're certain, burn it in the retort. So do you need to add this to all of the bodies? I don't know. <sighs> Forget it. Like, how do we figure out which body to start with? At least I can keep track of things. You know what? Screw this. I'm calling the police. Oh. 
Oh! <laughs> oh! How do you access the, um... You click the computer. Yeah, but how do you access? Remember he said that there was some sort of a... Okay, so here's more of this. They're not here anymore. Yeah. There's all sorts of things. What were you, what, can you finish your sentence? How do you access what? One of the tapes. How do you use the tapes, by the way? Oh, yeah. Oh, tab? Okay, oh, yeah. Okay, so there's the three tapes. Tape, okay, tape. Let's listen to tape two again. You should have fucking died. What? what? I will slip your ass open, and your last vision as they wither will be as the flesh being peeled from your legs. What? And all that will be left is eternal. What? It's starting oh. to take hold. It's starting to take hold. Oh, Jesus Christ. What? No, play tape two again. Banish a demon to hell. It must be bound to its chosen. At every moment, the demon is funneling its energy through you, weakening you until you are unable to resist. Identifying a demonic entity is a delicate balance. The further you are from possession, the more time you have. The closer you are, the more the demon will make itself known. Okay. Allowing you the information to get the state <laughs> and the body it's bound to. The only way I've found to tell how far along a possession is on your own is to scribble on a piece of paper. Don't think about it. Just scribble. Okay, well, so Look that thing... Oh. If you notice anything strange, it's starting to take hold. There's a notepad and a pencil right. on the desk in the front that room. That seems like a normal scribble. Checking from time to time can give an idea. Okay. How long you might have. But it burst into flame. He said that if it smolders, yeah. that was a sign of yeah. of something. But what was it a sign of? I think that like it revealed a sigil. Where is the sigil? Wait, turn the light off and then look around? Nope. Yeah, so, so it there's reveals a sigil. a sigil somewhere <laughs> in the building. Let me do this again. When a demonic marking is near, the parchment will smolder and combust, bringing the marking into the material world okay, to be found. So we need to look around and find it. Okay, so there Let's isn't. See. Let's see if it's like on a wall or something. It was in here, right? Yeah, but it could be anywhere in here. Where's the heckin' flashlight? Check the, like, bathroom and stuff. Check the other rooms. But wouldn't it be in here? Not necessarily. He, it says that he likes to hide it. Like, the demon oh. likes to hide it. Hello? <laughs> Okay. Matches. Oh. Oh, probably to burn the body. Oh my gosh, one left to, 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 yeah, you're right. To light the fire to burn one. Okay, let's like, uh, can, I, can I control for a second? I just want to look around a little bit. Okay. Okay, so oh, here, there's an incinerator. We here's the incinerator, yeah. Okay, so we need to... So there's how many bodies? Will Cox, Albert, Albert Whitney, Whitney, Jeremy Lopez. Lopez. Okay, so three bodies. One of these bodies is the right body to lock the demon with and burn. Yeah. We need to... Do a whole bunch of things. Oh, did you see something run across the screen? No. I thought uh, I saw something run from right to left in the room. Okay, let's let's look in here. I just want to have slower camera movements for a second so we can look for the sigil. So I'm going to take over for a second. I'm going to stand where we burned it. 
I think it burned a little bit to the right. Well, we were standing here, right? There is not, this is how much room there is to the right. No, it exploded like near the cat, like more here. Here? To the left. It exploded right here, I think. Okay. <clears throat> oh boy. <clears throat> oh boy. Sigil. Can I can I go back to the cabinet? Yeah. And look to see what the sigils are. So the sigils are these. Okay. I think I might just like start the process. Well, what is what the we're supposed process? to do? The process is we still need to do all the things that we normally oh, do. All the, all the body stuff? All the body stuff. Oh, I yeah. thought we were trying to figure out which body. Well, oh. Crummy old building. <sighs> Lock me in here. Scaring the shit out of me. Alright, let's just take the first body. Alright. Oh, uh, maybe check your settings. Moving the gurney shouldn't be that hard. I did the same thing for far too long before I realized it wasn't supposed to be like that. Ooh, did you see the Look sensitivity? I'll turn that up a little bit. Look at the feet jiggling. Ooh. All right, let's check you out. All right, so yeah, I think you still have to do the normal things, you know? You do? Yeah. Like the same things that you did before. Okay. Except you're also worried about demonic possession. <gasps> oh. Oh. oh my god. <sighs> We're gonna have to go to the Hello? break now. Hello? <gasps> He's sitting. Nope, nope. New job. I'm getting out of here. It's gonna be locked. Oh, it's not locked. I don't care how long I went to school. New career path. Fuck this. Maybe... Uh, no. What? Maybe... Everything's fine. It's... It's fine. Uh, what? No, I... I you're just... You're just... I'm just... I'm just, just saying things. I... Just need to get back to work. It's... It's fine. Oh! Whoa. Whoa! We can leave! What if we just leave? Do you want to leave? What happened? We can try. <sighs> oh no! Oh no! Fuck! Oh, you're kidding me! I can't believe him. Oh! Doorway. What am I doing? Ridiculous. I, I shouldn't be out here. It's my fucking fault. Get back to work. Oh. Okay, guess we gotta go back in the building. Well, hey, we explored all the options. Yeah. Also, I'm stuck here. All right, all right, all right. I guess it's a bit late to scribble now. I mean, we can check our scribble again. Will we get a new scribble? Uh, what about also like opening cabinets and stuff to look for the sigil? <gasps> oh, 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 <clears throat> that's it. Uh. <clears throat> okay, it's like a circle with a line down. Circle with a line down, circle with a line down. 
The, um, that one. This one? Yeah. So we just put that in one of them. All right. Okay, so we found a sigil. We found the sigil. Okay, let me see if I can burn another one. Okay, so it's not ready to burn yet. Cool, and we might not be in the right place. It said you have to walk around. How do we know which which person? How, how do we match it to the person? We have to, like, put the liquid on the body and oh, see how it Oh, and it will reveal it or something like that. Yeah, but I don't know, like... Hello? Okay. Maybe we have to, like, do more. Okay. Yeah, let's keep on... <gasps> oh! Oh, I don't like that. You have to be behind him to do the head. Kind of smiling. Yeah, I don't like that. Red team? Oh, is that something on his shoulder? Oh no, it's just a shadow, I think. How do you know when you've gotten it all? You, well, you just check all the things. Oh, so we need to do the foot. The other foot, yeah. Oh, do the legs not rotate? There we go. Yeah, right. she says, there we go. <laughs> okay. So we There's go to the computer. Pockets. Matchbox, one left. Okay. I'm going to listen to the number one recording again. The night shift database. A computer program combining all my findings into one reference point. Yeah, I think that's what we're missing. The database contains all the information on the process of expulsion, the tools used, and most nice importantly, job. all the markings of the known demonic names. Now we need the code. If you ever forget what to do, replay these tapes or look it up in the database. The collection of demonic names is the most crucial piece to the puzzle. You will need this information. Okay. My ID card is in my personal belongings drawer. Oh. On the back is the passcode to access oh. it. Use it. All right, ID. We need to find his ID. What was that? His personal drawer? It could be at the front desk. Typhon conversations. Huh. It could be the front desk. All right, yeah, let's look there. Yeah, so we need his ID card. I think we should, like, get that first, kind of. Yeah. Oh. Ah. Ah. Full access. Can you turn it around? 22723. 22723. Two two seven. Oh, there's also two two seven two three. Whoa! Whoa. Oh. Did you say, "Hey, can you help me"? Is that what you heard? I heard. I heard, "Hey, can you help me?" Raymond, I really need a key to the hatch outside. Cleaner is low, and you mentioned having some down there before. I know you don't trust anyone to go down there. Down there. I mean, copy of the key would make things a lot easier. Is that the back door? Oh. Is it a basement? Oh, that's yours. She said, you can help me, or can you help me? Oh, so she did say that. Oh, another key. An old key, okay. Can I have it? Oh, I can. Very convenient that there's lights on these. <laughs> All right. Okay. What was Access it? code 22723. 22723. Okay. <clears throat> This database is a collection of all my findings related to the banishment of covetous demons, the history of the demonic, and the tools I have found through my research. Years of travel and piecing together whatever relics have been compiled here. Navigation bar at the right leads to the following subsections. Path to banishment. Embalm each body with a special reagent from the cabinet. So that's what we need to do. We need to embalm each, each body. Use letting strips from the cabinet to reveal demonic sigils 
Compare the found demonic sigils to the demons' names in the Night Shift database. So, like, what is the next step? Do we keep embalming? I think we keep embalming. So we need to. Also, I'll, um, I'm seeing the mods are having to um, give lots of spoiler warnings. Um, if we get stuck and we want a hint from you guys, because we're just too stuck to figure it out, we'll specifically say like, hey, we're stuck, give us a hint. Um, but if we're just like saying like, oh, do we do this, do we do that to each other? Um, we're not actually looking for you guys to tell us. Like, we have more fun if we can kind of figure it out on our own. So we'll specifically ask you guys. Yeah. Um, I know that, that people are just trying to be helpful and stuff, but just so the mods don't have to keep giving warnings or, like, time anyone out. You know, I thought I would say it. Yeah, so interesting. So the history of the demonic, I clicked here. Okay. And it says, whoa, 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 whoa. <gasps> oh, my God. That... <gasps> <gasps> oh! That got me. That got me. That was the first one that gave me like some shivers. <gasps> oh. <laughs> that was creepy. Oh, that was creepy. That was, that was creepy. creepy. That was creepy. I didn't expect that. Oh my like gosh. I know. None of this is integral to banishment, but this knowledge still might be useful. So there's a lot here. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's focus on the other stuff first, because it said this isn't crucial. Yeah. All right. So my main question, I think, is like, do we continue with the embalming first, or do we find the next sigil? I think I'll, I'll keep on seeing a strip to see if um, uh, um, if anything else happens. But I think we we got to start embalming them. Okay. Well, learning the name of the demonic entity is more about waiting, identifying which body is experiencing demonic tendency requires paying close attention. Well, any of the bodies can be manipulated. It's far easier for the entity to control its own vessel. Sudden movement, small or large, can be a so sign of ten tendency. Tendency, like tendency. it's like he's a oh, tenant. Oh, yeah. If a body appears to be more active than others or strange markings start to appear, it may be a sign of demonic ten tendency. However, if the demon is trying its best to remain elusive, it may manifest these manipulations in other bodies, which is why it's important to take note of which bodies are experiencing these events. The more events are linked to a specific body, more likely it is to be the chosen vessel. Mm -hmm. Oh. So appearance of new markings, sudden movements, repeat movements. Yeah. Oh, okay. So look at a body multiple times. So we have here rash, this mild abrasion, this. So we know that, mm -hmm. like, you know, there. We have a record of what it was originally, and then we need to like. I might even really quickly. Um, pull out the clipboard. So mild abrasion on the shoulder. What was that? What does that look like? I've already died, Kiwi. What? I've already died? <gasps> I think the mild abrasion is right there. Yeah. Okay, so that's what a mild abrasion looks like. Right arm. Corrosis. Right leg, something with an H. Okay, so that's a, a mole. Right here. So that's what that is. So let's look look to see what that is. That's keratosis. The one that starts with H is a mole. I think something. And a rash. I think just keep looking at them. So that's what a rash looks like. Do you want to okay. rotate the other way? I was just looking up, like, to get a reference point of, like, what each of these looks like. The examples it showed in the book were, like, symbols and big scratches. Symbols, yes. Yeah. So I, I think, like... They'll probably be pretty obvious. Yeah. Okay. So let's go here. Tools to combat. So it'll probably be one of these three names. Oh. Okay, back. Oops. Keep on pressing back, but I want to go home instead. Hmm. Tools to combat demonic forces. An entity must be bound to its original vessel and that vessel destroyed in order to stop the process of possession. 
Throughout my work, I've managed to discover and establish a set of tools to bring about the banishment of demonic entities. The occupied body must contain the reagent, a mark must have the correct demonic name, the mark must be placed on the correct body and burned. Below are the tools I'm aware of in their usage. So we have the reagent, we have the letting parchment, and the mark. Okay. <coughs> now let's enter things into the record system. Okay. Age, head, left shoulder, right shoulder, left leg, okay. left arm, okay. right arm, right leg. Submit. Strip. <laughs> Any letting strips? I'm just gonna like walk around with this every now and then. You need to file a copy up front. Okay, we filed the copy. Still doing work here. <laughs> I would go to the front because she said it. You know. Eva, Eva, Eva. Uh, embalming report. Uh, it's time to embalm. Oh. All right. Why your jaw shut? Yay! Yay! So I did that last time. Yeah, do you no, want to? No, 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 you, I did it last you time. You did that last time. I'll do this, and then you have to do the things that I did. Okay, deal. It'll be good for us to learn. Malene, thank you for the gifted sub. Funeral fact we do a lot of paperwork. A lot of paperwork. Ooh! Oh, uh, you just put it up and then click it. Oh, you pull it up and then click. Ah. Uh. It's very dusty in here. Why is it so many times? <laughs> I don't like that. Maybe it takes a lot of punches to get through bone. Mm, no. Now you're doing that on purpose. There we go. And next, I think the eyeballs. Um, okay. These are eye caps. Did you do that? Or did no, I, I think that? you did the rest of it because <laughs> I right. got too squeamish. Those look like the eye caps. Oh. You're correct. All right, okay. go for it. <laughs> oh, Lord. This is a far cry from Minecraft. I think you have to open them oh. and then put them in and then close them. I see. So he right. is now wired shut and fully closed. So if he opens his eyes. Yeah. Mix some bombing fluid and pump. Yeah. Okay, reagent is in the old cabinet. Oh yeah, that's yeah. the. <laughs> so go over to the pump and open up the lid. Yep. And then grab one at a time. Um, Humectant was one. Yep. Then go over here, right click. And humectant. <gasps> outside, 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 outside. Look at the door. Look at the door. There, right. there, there. The, 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 the window? window? You said the yeah. door. Oh, sorry. Open it up. Oh, no. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh. Okay, next fluid. Uh, I don't think that. Uh, nope. Yeah, it's not that. Um, maybe that one? That was on. Yeah. Right click it. And then check your checklist, press space again. Methanol, Methanol and, and glutacol. Glutorhoride. Uh, no. Oh. Yeah. yeah. I can't hold anything else. Oh. Oh. Here, let me uh, try taking over. We need to. I can't use that here. Can I put it back? I can't use that here. Let me go into the C. Cold storage, choker. Is there any resin in those cupboards? Take use, leave a inventory UI. 
Oh, the heart rate monitor's charged up, Chad is wondering. Drop. Ah, okay, ah. cool. And you pull that menu up with tab. Yeah. Yeah. So I wonder, to, to, so if, if you don't want to take it, right click and that won't take Instead it. Instead of E. Instead of E. Got e it. takes it. Yeah. Okay. Oh. <gasps> Go to the front door. Hold on. I just want to do my job. Okay. <laughs> Press Q. It's open. Press Q. Just to see if something it burns. Someone's in here with you. A new friend. I do not like that. <laughs> they just wanted out of the rain. Chat's wondering if you leveled the dead guy. <laughs> no. No. We he's, didn't even level the bad guy or he, the, the dead guy. He's specifically not level though. He needs to drain. <laughs> Okay, you need to find okay. one more thing. Press Q to put it away. Um, um, the last one is in here. Oh, no, there's one other thing. Oh, you, you do need to add that. Go ahead and add that. You need to oh, get methanol. methanol. We'll go ahead and add this. Yeah, go ahead and add that. Right there. Baleful reagent. Methanol, methanol. Where have I not checked? Oh. Oh, over there. Wait, you gotta say what? Straight what? ahead. Methanol. methanol. Yeah. I did not like that ooh noise. All right, now you gotta open them up. <laughs> I need a scalpel. <gasps> Open the door. I can't. <laughs> oh no. Oh. 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 Open it up. I'm trying. <laughs> oh my. Oh no 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 I did not like. I did not like. Okay, scalpels. Um, I know where they are down down here. Yeah, somewhere. That one. Nope. Oh yeah, you need to grab those two. I think. Grab that. Okay. And then uh. grab that. I think that th that's it. Okay. Oh, you gotta do the pokey poke. Ugh. Okay. I'm trying to get the uh, heart rate monitors going again. Okay, and now I need to plug in the tube. <clears throat> yeah, here, take this. Oh, yeah. Okay, we'll see if they have a charge. Let's see which one. Which one did I turn on? <laughs> also, who's this who's? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Evan will get those. Okay, use forceps to clamp. Forceps and tubing. Okay, that's what I'm looking for next. Forceps. What's that? No. No. Okay, I have your heart rate on at least. Do I need more forceps? I already have forceps. I already did the forceps. I need the tubing. Here, can I see? Yeah. Um, I already put the forceps in there. I think you might just need to... Um, uh, back. Do I need to like grab the tube? I wonder how your sanity... Oop! Oh! oh. <clears throat> 
Oh. It's starting to get worse. Yeah. Tube. We don't need to do the IV bag yet, no? No, we need to... It says tubing. Because everything that you grab is in brackets, so I'm assuming you need to grab the troop tubing or something. Is this tubing? Tubing! Tubing! Oh, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Ooh. Okay, now All we right. turn on the machine. You see that? There's someone in the wall. There's definitely someone there in the something. wall. All right. Remove the tubes and close incision. All right. Oh. Rouse. Oh. So Fill an empty, an empty IV bag then, with cavity fluid. So here, I think we dropped an IV bag down here somewhere, but we have plenty. Yeah. It might have just put it back in its place. Mm. And now we put... Oh, trocar. Trocar is um in the drawers over here. Yeah, it's one of these things. Yeah. Okay, you're gonna do the this time. Okay. <laughs> right in the belly button. No, not the belly button. <laughs> Above the belly button. You just gotta wiggle it around. Yeah. <laughs> and every time it stops, you have to wiggle it again. Ah! <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Funeral fact. Tubing connects to a tool called the cranula. That's the piece that actually goes inside a vessel, not a great big tube. Inaccurate. <laughs> I love these funeral facts. There we go. Okay. Mix cleaners in the bathroom closet to create tank cleaner. Who's gonna be waiting in the bathroom closet? Evidently there's, there's lots of inaccuracies. Uh, funeral fact. Evan is right. You have to be unlevel for drainage. Heads up. <laughs> it's just the one tank, right? I'm sorry. I've been reading funeral facts. No, for the... So I'm doing the... I'm doing this right here. Um, mix cleaner in the bathroom to create tank cleaner. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. I just grab one tank. You gra yeah, you grab tank, then you, you do this. Oh, I do this? Yeah. You, you do that? I think right-click. Oh, right-click. Okay. All right. I think you did it. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Funeral fact. That gargle sound is accurate, unfortunately. Uh, tank cleaner. I'm clicking it. Oh, you have to open up. Oh, you have to open it first. Oh. Okay. Moisturizer is the next thing. That was something that looked like these. That's tubing. Okay. Not that. Right click. Can't they have better lights here? Oh, yeah. moisturizing oh, light. There we go. Oops. What if his face does something creepy? It might, even with all the preparations that you did. All right. All right. You did it, baby. Okay. Return body to cold storage. Let's see how our sanity is. Okay. Same. We're still doing okay. But it's like, so we didn't figure anything out with his body. Mm, yeah, you're, you're right. 
But we still don't have all the marks yet. You know what I mean? Yeah. Maybe we'll get another mark once we like start the next body. Jeremy Lopez. Yes, we need to check the body. If it like does it get does it get does it change? You know what like I mean? Check it again later. Yeah. body and there's no possession signs on the first one no no like scratches or anything yeah he, he did do some activity like he stood up or sat up or stuff like that you know yeah not much though So maybe it's not him. All right. Inspection time. All right. It's just a little thing on the foot. Little thing on the hand. Something on the back. I think I was just clicking and I clicked on this thing. Oh, okay. Yeah, so we know what normal things look like. Yeah. So we need to be on the lookout. <gasps> oh, the light turned off. The light definitely turned off. Don't like that. Don't like that for us. Don't like that. I'm going to turn on the light. <laughs> <laughs> You didn't get me that. <laughs> oh. There we go. All right. Oh, nice and smooth. Can we burn one of these yet? Like, I want yeah, the hello. second sigil, right? <gasps> oh, oh, oh. Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay. Oh, you know, maybe the light switch was like a sign. Oh. Because it happened right by the light switch. Okay, let's look around. Floor, ceiling, cabinets. Can you look? It, it happened in the hallway. Can you look at like the ceiling and the floor in the hallway? Yeah, the last one was in a drawer, so it probably isn't in a drawer again. Let's look and let's look. Also, is the bathroom door shut now? I don't think we shut it. Uh oh! Oh, there it is. Oh! Did you shut okay. that door? I shut it. Yeah. Okay. All right. So it's uh. <laughs> kind of like a, a seven with a asterisk okay. near it. Yeah, like a seven. All right. Hey, we have two of the marks, baby. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Uh, bottom to the left. Left, left, left. That one. Yeah, that's it. That's definitely it. Hopefully this oh. is in the right order. Did you hear that moaning? Yeah, so we need to choose the right body. Oh, uh, oh, <clears throat> it's starting to get worse. It's starting to get worse. Oh yeah, so I need to put this in the computer. Entry two, name, age, head, left shoulder. Sounded like a whale? Yeah, it did kind of sound like a whale. Mary Coon, thank you for the 27 months sub. So loud. <laughs> like we're still See, trying the to most work. unrealistic aspect of this whole thing is that the printer hasn't malfunctioned yet. Is that the printer's still working? Yeah. <laughs> you know what we should do? <gasps> That's laughing or crying. I think I heard it too. You heard it? Yeah. We need another embalming strip or uh Oh yeah, we should just keep strip. that on us for when creepy things happen. Yeah, like hello. Do we and need to run around everywhere every time? Also, can we open that back door now? Oh. <gasps>
What's this? What's this? That's a that's the office. Oh, what is that? That's what we have. We found a key to that. That's not it. Oh, I thought we had a key. That note that we found mentioned something about it. There's still another key to find. Oh, I bet that's a secret ending. You know what I mean? I like, know. I bet there's like multiple endings. And like, one, one ending is the secret ending. Should we just continue with the embalming for now? Yeah. <laughs> Since we just found a sigil, it probably means we're not gonna find another one anytime soon. I might play, oh! <gasps> She's peeking in on us! <gasps> Sneak up on her, sneak up. I can't use that here. The lighting strip? Um, hello? Excuse me, ma'am. Oh. 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 She made like bone noises. Man, what if what if we had have seen her from this side? Oh man, both are creepy. Ooh. Okay, so there's no embalming strip or uh, letting strip that we need to do. I'll go ahead and um, close this. Okay, so we need to seal the, the demon in the right body and then burn it. Mm -hmm. All right, let's do the needle injectors and the uh, thingy things. No, not this, not that. It's these. All right. Wait. Open wide. Oh. I don't like. <laughs> I don't think the game anticipated you walking around. Oh yeah, apparently we we're supposed to see her from the other side. <laughs> That's funny. So we didn't get the full there creepy factor. No. Okay, now we need to get the eye things. I think the bottom. I oh, come here. Instead, you saw her booty. Yeah, we did. All right. No closing your eyes. Stay right. nice and tight. You mean no opening? No, what I say? Closing. <laughs> yeah. Okay. You know what's scary about this though? We don't know what full We don't know what full crazy is. Yeah. Put this in. That's fine. Put this in. Put this in. So we're missing two methanol formaldehyde. and formaldehyde. The methanol was in a weird spot. I think it was in the back room. the formaldehyde was just on the counter. You did that one already. Have you checked all three of the left ones? No. Formaldehyde. All right. I think the other was in like the back room. Or, oh, oh it was right, right there. Here. Yeah. Okay, I knew it was on like a different shelf. Eh. All right. Make an incision with a scalpel, then also get forceps and tubing. Scalpel, forceps, tubing. That was a scalpel. The forceps. Yeah. The tubing was in a tubing, cabinet. Right yeah. here. Okay, look, we're getting good. Oh. 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 Scalpel. Forceps. Or forceps. Yeah. And then two. And then we turn it on. <laughs> what? 
Look, uh, look, look oh, the... there's a butt train. <laughs> ah. Great time for a butt train, everyone. Look at all your beautiful butts. Yeah, that's a good distraction from everything that's going on. Yeah, stay farther away. It's so loud. Yeah, I'm going to turn the game volume down. Yeah, during this part. I think that's good enough. Yeah, it doesn't really say how long to run it. I think until it turns clear. Clear. Alrighty. Yeah. I mean, it's accurate that it is. <gasps> oh! She went up. She went, whoo. Should I play any tapes again? To like go through what we're supposed to do? I'll play a tape while I go through some At stuff. every moment, the demon is funneling its energy through you, weakening you until you are unable to resist. Identifying a demonic I'll entity is a delicate balance. The further you are from possession, yeah, bring left the more time left, you left. have. The closer you are, the more the demon will make itself known, allowing you the information to guess its name and the body it's bound to. Did that George is open on the its own? The only way okay. I've found to right tell there. how far along a possession is on your yeah. own is to scribble on a piece of paper. Don't think Pro about bar. it. Just scribble. It's one of these. Look carefully. If you notice anything strange, it's starting to take hold. <gasps> There's a notepad and a pencil on the desk in the front room. Checking from time to time can give an idea of how long you might have. Okay, so that was tape three. I don't like that this one is underneath the belly button. Oh yeah, you're right. Why is it in a different spot? Oh, I don't like the yeah. email. Oh. oh, the telephone's a lie, telephone's a lie. It was disconnected. Uh, hello? I, I need to report a missing person. Uh, sorry, uh, her name's Rebecca. <gasps> That's our name. What? We're Rebecca. She, but we're not 14. She, she has a drug problem. I, I, I don't know. Uh, she was here at the house. Slit your I understand that. I need you to check them. All right. All right. Uh, I'll keep an eye out. Thank you. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, no. So wait, we're Rebecca Owens? Well, no. I, our name is Rebecca. Oh, we are Rebecca Owens. Yep. We're certainly not 14. Imagine but but it says internship. that we have, like, you know, maybe that was like a moment from our past. Yeah. Saying we have a drug problem. The demon was bringing it to us, trying to weaken us. Saying, oh, I know about your past. Whoa, this door wasn't closed. The Whoa. Clo oh, no. Do not like, do not like. <laughs> it was so dark. That took a lot of bravery on my part. Yeah. Look at these. Cremation bags. Probably for later when we burn the body. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, oh boy, so we just oh did boy, the um, oh. IV bag part. Yep. Mix cleaners in the bathroom. Okay. Oh. Uh, hello? I, I need to report a missing person. What if we're the she, demon? She, she, well, she has a drug problem. We are she, getting she possessed. Rebecca! Rebecca! Rebecca, Rebecca, oh my god, oh my god, no, no, baby, baby, no. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Fuck, okay, baby, don't worry. It's okay, it's okay, don't I'll, I'll get you out of here. The police are, are just right, right up there. I, I, I'm coming back, I'm coming right back. Hey, hey, I found her, down here. Whoa! Whoa! Your 
your dad or someone <laughs> fell and de or, died. Or was pushed, because also it looked like half his face was ripped off. Okay, I think we didn't have a drug problem. I think the demon has been... I think the demon has been with us since we were 14. And I think the demon killed our dad. All right, let's get out of here. I think let's bring out one of these again. The coffee cup's back in place. <gasps> Who put the coffee back up? Who did this? Who did this? <laughs> I'm just going to do a full sweep with this strip. Yeah. One more time. Hello. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, 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 oh. oh. It looks like H with a G on the bottom. H G. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Ooh. We're almost there. We're almost there. We're, do we're we're doing pretty good on the letting strip side of things. You know yeah. what I mean? Um, and this that is one. It. Yep. Okay. Okay. Let's take another one of these. Yeah. Keep it on us. All right. We have that ready to go. <laughs> the jump screw broke the heart rate monitor. Has it been frozen again? It might just be too dead. Yeah, it uh, it, it's not working anymore. Okay. Oh, you yeah. know, guys, we'll we'll save it for next time. Here, do you want to put on the charger? Yeah. Our Quince, thank you so much for the five gifted subs. Thank you thank for you. the support. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks for a little distraction from yeah, yeah. this. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> okay. So speaking of which, let's see. Okay, cleaners. Moisturizer, I think that was down here. I think that was the bottom. Oh no, up there. Right there. Oh, right there. there, there yeah. Okay. All right. And I know it's it's gonna like it's it's, it's gonna get us sometime right. soon with the body. I know. None of these bodies have like jumped at us or really like. Yeah, Been I'm too like, active. I'm like, are there gonna be like additional marks like that we need to check for and stuff? You know, like. Yeah, I haven't seen any additional marks. But we also haven't like rechecked a ton, you know. Yeah. Maybe that comes later. Maybe. Okay. Um. Return body. I'll do this. I'm pretty good okay. with the. Uh, with the steering. Oh, hype train! Thank you guys for the hype train. <laughs> Thanks for the hype. The scary hype. The scary hype. And <laughs> what happened? Did we get pushed? What happened? Whoa. <gasps> oh. Is it a corpse? Jeremy? His. Will? Wish I had a heckin' flashlight. Maybe it's from the incinerator. He doesn't look like he has any new marks. Let's put our, our dude up. Balm someone with resin. Oops. Oh, uh, occupado. <laughs> uh, that's I a good. Think, that's a great one. I think that's actually what they do. In, you know, in that one exhibit. Oh, the like bodies exhibit. Yeah. Oh yeah. 
use it with resin? I guess that kind of makes sense. Some resin like substance. Alright, Will, you're up. <laughs> Not near enough resin in this episode, if you ask me. Ah! It's oh called plastination. Next main channel video embalming with resin. Fun fact, Body World uses plastic, not resin. Oh. oh. I went and saw that. Did you ever see it? No. I was disappointed that I missed it. It's uh, kind of eerie. Yeah, I would imagine. Eerie. Okay, this guy is a skinny dude. He's got a few scratches okay. and stuff like that. Okay, what do we do? All right, record anything. I'm going to play one more tape. I'm going to play tape three. Just while we At do every this. Moment. Demon is fun oh, no. we just did that one. to banish a demon to hell. It must be bound to its chosen body and burned. The three objects <gasps> in this cabinet are your tools. Write that down. First, the clay tablet in the center is called a mark. Placing the smaller pieces in the correct configuration will spell the demon's name. Mm. We need to figure out the configuration. Second, the bottles on the top shelf are a special reagent that will react to the Add a bottle to the embalming mixture during the process. When the mark is placed on the correct body, with the reagent inside, it will force the demon to become bound to it. Pay attention to signs that you have chosen correctly. They can be obvious or extremely subtle. Does this mean that Once this you are is certain him? the demon is bound to its vessel, burn it. Finally, the pieces of paper on the right are called letting strips. It must inscribe the sigils of its name in our world to begin the evocation. You will need to uncover these sigils to use them. Hold a letting strip up while wandering the mortuary. If it begins to smolder and burn, you're close. When the paper combusts, the sigil has been revealed somewhere in that area. They can be anywhere. So look on walls, under objects, inside furniture. Anywhere. The demon will inscribe its sigils over time to this, try and hide them, so check regularly. Once you uncover the sigils, use the Night Shift database to decide which demon yeah. you're dealing with, and use that knowledge to create the mark. The steps are simple. Add the reagent to the embalming mixture, <gasps> uncover the sigils, build the mark and place it on the body. Whoa, then, which one is that? Certain, it looks like the same the guy. Return. Or it could be the first guy. Go to him. Um, does that mean that it's this dude? It looks like it this looks dude. It looks like him. It looks like this dude. He's wiggling and wobbling. <laughs> oh. It's this guy. It's this guy. Yeah. Oh no. He's still there. Hello, my dude. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, that got me. It's this dude. It's got to be this it's dude. Him. Okay, so it's this. He guy. has a mark on his arm. And that just happened. Yeah. Okay, so what do we do? We need, we, need, we need to burn one more strip to complete the sigil. We also but, need to figure out the right order of the symbols. Do we? Yes. That's what he just said in the tape. Oh, Caitlin. We need oh, to use Caitlin. the database. What? Look at this. Okay, so the circle, uh, so three circles and a triangle with like crosses in between. Three circles, three circles, triangle, three circles, triangle. Night shift database. Home. Sigils of demonic names. No. Uh, uh. I thought it might be a sigil of the demonic name. It's not here either. Wait, when you go back to the computer, it looks like you could click on those three, like, houses or whatever. Look, go to the word. Oh. Ball met. Interesting. So one of these is going to tell us the order that our symbols need to be in. 
It's none of those. How do you know it's none of these? Because, well, in that last one, it didn't have, it could be one of these. I was looking for sim symbols. Oh, it combines into that. All of these have that one in it. Well, so or look, so if you, you can, you can see the symbols and know if they're ones we've done or not. It's none of these. Oh. We need the H. Okay, it could be this one. It could be the third. Or the, yeah, the third. The third? Yeah, because we've done that H. We've done that little J. And yeah. then we've done the little one that looks like a compass. Okay. We still need the last uh, thing. We might be able to use process of elimination. We might be able to. How, how crazy are we? Oh, oh, it's a new one. It's a new one. I'm still wondering what, what we need to do in that. In that, like, basement? Yeah, where's that key? We found the key when we were looking through the drawers. What's that this? I Whoa. Oh. Oh. You could try the same code. 22723. Okay, there's oh. more there's more going on here, guys. Oh, oh, oh. I missed There's it. a I, dude there. There's a dude there. Oh my god. I looked down for a second. And I missed it. The keys are on the right cabinet, near where our cards were. I thought the keys were in this cabinet. Yes, yeah, so we got we got a key from right here. Can you open the other drawers? We it's like, not gonna change if you keep opening it. Yeah, that key. I think extra keys. Oh, that's just extra keys. Oh, okay. In my brain, I was like, there's two sets of, there's two keys that we found. Okay, His he was born April 17th. 1944. Maybe there's maybe like 1944. Oh. Raymond, I, I really need the key to the hatch outside. Cleaner is low. And you mentioned having some down there. I know you don't trust anyone to go down there. Having a copy of the key would make it a lot easier for everyone. So is that, that hatch says a copy. Outside, right. Hold on, hold on. That says a copy of the key. Is that not it? Yeah, why so can't weird. I has? Why can't I take? We get, oh, it's closed. Hello? Hello? All right, I'm gonna look through these one more time, see if there's anything we missed. Oh my God, my phone just buzzed and it freaked me out. Nothing here. That large old key, that has to be to something, right? Yeah, I would think that that's... Is key. it behind the painting? I would think that the large old, old key is the key to the basement thing. Right. Well, we can keep going with the embalming. I'm very suspicious. Though. Oh my God. Our reflection scared me. Well, it's starting to have that effect. Yeah, it's starting to look weird. It's starting to have that effect. Maybe if you're slow enough. I can't enough. use that here. Are you sure? Yes. Yes. Uh-oh. Let's keep going. Oh, it's starting. It's been, it's been starting. Should I run to that outside to try the key one more time? Uh, you could try, but we could also just keep going with like, like I wonder if it's gonna make you do the body task. 
before you do this. No matter what, yeah. It could, it could, yeah. That's not it. Come on. <sighs> okay, I'll finish this. What, what process am I at? Okay, documenting. Entry three, last dude, Wilcox. 36, ooh, young. What a Left shame. Shoulder. Demon possessed too. Left leg. Left arm. Are we not gonna enter the demonic symbol on his right arm? Yeah. Right leg, right arm. You have to click the box first, then the thing, yeah. Is that it? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. <laughs> Baba Bradius, thank you for the sub. And Eagle Eyes, thank you for the eight months. Did I miss these earlier? K Hobbs, thank you so much for the five gifted subs. We appreciate it. And thank Emmy you. Lou, thank you for the five gifted subs. Thank you, thank you. Why right, look at this one more time? Okay. So the night shift. So we did the sigil of the demonic names. We can't do that yet because we need the full set. History of the de demonic, that doesn't necessarily help. There's so the path to banishment. A bomb each body with a special reagent. We're doing that. Use lighting strips, we're doing that. I mean, okay. we need, we do need to finish embalming this body. Yeah. Because it needs a special reagent. Yeah. Is this game- Pay attention to each body for demonic activity. That's definitely, this, this one has the most. Yeah. Note bringing, bringing an, an embalmed all... body about to re-inspect cha for changes might be necessary. Yep. Place the mark on the body that we believe to be demonic. Okay. I, but I think we do need to finish. I was going to say, if we pause this game, does the time keep going? Rebecca, <gasps> it's me. It's <gasps> your grandma. That's not you, grandma. I need you to let me in. Do not. That's uh, not grandma. Don't you love your grandma? No, grandma. Get away. I can't go on with my business. It's so cold out here. I have to come in. Let me in. Oh, she's going to turn real evil. I can't use that here. Just, it's going to do something. Because it's getting more. Stop it, you little bitch! Oh. 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 My. Grandma's mean. Grandma, why do you say that? That's a okay, bad word. Okay, it's still like weird. Oh. Wait, what happens if you open the door, the window? Ah! All right, let me run everywhere. Oftentimes, this happens after like the scary thing. Okay, it has gone back to normal now. We haven't had it. Oh no, we had a scary thing in here. We've and we had one in here. How many other rooms are there for this to It might activate? be a matter of like timing. <clears throat> like mm. we might have to get a certain percentage through. Yeah, I think that I think you have to do I think keep to... going on the body. All right. What I was about to ask is can we pause in this game so I can go rest in a room? I don't want to miss anything. Like what right. does it pause our time? Try I'll let you know if anything happens. Go for it. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Break time. Oh my gosh, chat. This game is more intense than I, uh, than I thought. I thought I was going to be totally fine. Squally Bunny, thank you for the nine months. I'm not, oh yeah, prank, prank. It's time to prank, guys. Um...
Hello. 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 I like this. Hello, everybody. How's it going? Hi. How are you guys today? I'm your grandma. I have Cheetos for you. Let me in. I lied. I'm not your grandma. Are you going to? Okay. Uh. I actually want those Cheetos back. Oh. Sorry. I gotta go around. Cheetos. Cheetos for me. I don't know how to turn off the voice modulator. I'm sorry. I'm sure it's annoying. You can blame Evan. Let's see if a crunch reverberates. This looks cool in here, y'all. This looks cool. I'm a cool demon. I'm gonna sing my demon songs. I'm a demon grandma. I brought Cheetos instead of cookies. Cause that's what I like. Ah. How do I turn this off? Hello? Hey! I figured it out. Sorry, that was probably getting <laughs> annoying. And hard to understand. It's a demon eating Cheetos. <laughs> oh, sing science time with us. Ready for science. It's science time. Yeah. Extra demonic. Oh. Do you hear your own voices the whole time you're streaming? Yes. Um, we can hear ourselves in here. Though if I don't have my headphones on, I don't know what effects Evan has done. So. <gasps> Did you guys hear that? The game is paused. There was a creak. Maybe things do keep going. <laughs> Dema, demonetized. <laughs> Gavin, thanks. Thank you so much for the prime sub. Did you scare yourself? I didn't scare myself. I heard a creak. Now maybe that's just a normal thing that happens in the pause screen, but I don't know that. It might not be. Wow, my eye makeup looks great and all red. <laughs> hey, baby. I didn't do any. I just hung out and I sang songs. Okay. There's a, the mute switch if you need it for, um. I forgot. All righty, guys. We're, oh. Ah! Ah! Maybe that was the creak, you guys. I heard a creak when you were gone. Do you see him? He did a little like, <laughs> wiggle. He did a dance. He did a dance. Okay, what's up with this code? I really... You could try putting in the birthday. Can you, can you write down his birthday? I just look at it again. I'll tell you. Okay, so April it could 17th. be... Let's try 19... It is technically 4 17 1944. All right. So I'll write that. But it could just like only be 1944. So 4, 17. 19, 1944. Okay, try 17, 1944. 17? 
se it's seven numbers. Well, four, seventeen, nineteen, forty-four is seven numbers. Do does our ID card have a birthday? Oh, seven numbers. What if it's seven? T what what if it's European? European. Yeah. So day, month, year. Oh, you could try that. But what about year? Well, this year, year, month, day. I feel like it would be more 19, obvious. Nineteen. Forty-four. Forty-four. Four seventeen. Ah. You, let's check. If, does our card have a birthday? Maybe that little dancing boy knows. No. Okay. Maybe hit the pound key. Huh. European, you mean the rest of the world? Yeah. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> That's right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <sighs> okay. Well, we still haven't found it yet. Yeah. All right. I, you'd think it'd be the, the, the thing. All right. Let's get the needles and the, the things. That's not it. It's dark in there. Oh, oh, lady, a lady. Oh, she's gonna be close to the next time. Oh, she's oh. closer. She's like a, a cat. She's gonna be right here. Oh no. Oh, oh. oh that made my butt cheeks clench. <laughs> that was a clencher. That was a clencher. That was a clencher. <laughs> Alrighty. Alrighty, my friend. This won't hurt a bit because you're dead, right? You're dead, right? You're dead, right? Alrighty. There we go. Plot twist. He's not dead. <laughs> Right. I'm half tempted to just try various other combinations. Well, you can try combinations based on that date, but it's not fun if you just randomly guess it. You know what I mean? And it's also possibly a waste of time. Yeah. Like with so many seven digits potentially. Yeah, too many permutations to brute force it. I agree. Yeah, okay. Like if you want to try variations based on his um, birthday. Yeah. Ooh, maybe. Ooh, wait, pull up your card. Right. Maybe it's Will's birthday. Oh. <gasps> Where is it? What's going on? I bet the last clue is in that un d downstairs area. be out there. Oh, it stopped. Because we already got one right here. What? Oh, that noise. Okay. okay. Make some balm and fluid. This one. Yep. What does the scribble test do again? It tells you, like, how far along you are in terms of possession. We're going so fast now. Yeah. Formaldehyde. It's on the left. Left, left, left. It's in the left cabinet. I got that one. Oh, left. Okay. I knew it was on the left somewhere. Oh, oh darling! <laughs> oh, oh, oh. oh my god! I saw blood splatter! Sounds like the 
grudge. Ooh, it's still dark. All right. I always think that there's like blood on the rug and on that little like runner. I'll smack you with this coffee. I'll, I'll, I'll hit you in the head. I hit you on the head. That's gonna get in the way. Have you heard how your morning cup of joe? You know, time is of the essence. So is coffee. <laughs> <sighs> okay. Scalpel. Check. Um, forceps, check. Um, tubing, check. We got all the boys here. I'm missing something. Uh, four, four steps. Tubing. computer and you pull up his records is his it's just his age not his birthday actually mm -hmm. it's just age hey Ren, thank you for the year of savage i saw a person down the hall before you turned everything red Dude. Casual Wednesday evening. <laughs> Can you walk or look mm. around? Mm. Mm. I can. This seems fine. Oh, whoa, whoa, did you see that? Did you see that? Did you no. see that? There's a fee there's a figure that crawled back into the darkness. Look look over there. You see it? See him? Ooh. Oh, yeah, I saw that one. So difficult for little Rebecca. Is it going to be us? Just no, it's me. Real. This would be. This would be. Can you click on him? Up your clipboard. Something. Let, Let me, me in. in. Let me in. So we might need to look for something. Oh. Did we did we miss a game mechanic? Let me in. Can we try like right clicking and left clicking? Yeah. Can we move the gurney? Oh, move the gurney. Nope. No. I think that we were supposed to grab something. Uh, I feel like it wouldn't like take us here if we couldn't get out of this. Ooh. What's up there? I don't know. Yeah, what is that? Mm 
Oh, it's a dude. Hi, dude. What's that? Plat. Oh. It's just the edge of the wall. What do we do? I don't know. I think this is supposed to be a really scary part, but I, <laughs> I don't know what the game mechanic if, if is. If we get too stuck, we'll <laughs> ask chat. Yeah. But. So if we pull up our inventory, does anything pop up? Like tab? No. I can only do space. Okay, but it just no says tab. let me in. And I can only click on one part. His neck. My guess is a, like a scalpel, right? Yeah. I've watched three playthroughs of this and I haven't seen this. What? So you can't, you left clicked and right clicked with that hand when the hand came up? Here, you can try it. <clears throat> oh, here, uh, here look, look around the body. Um, is there something here? Oh. 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 You killed, killed him. him. You threw away his love with your selfish sin. In his final moments, he regretted you. What? Is she talking you about our father? Killed. What is this? Is that a heart? It's, it's a, a rock. rock. Let's try to use it on the dude. Be more comforting. <laughs> Just let me hear Rebecca. It will be over. I think that's our that's our father. Because this guy This guy has facial that? hair. I did hear that. This guy has facial hair. I think that was our father, because also when he fell in the flashback, he had yeah. his face, like part of his face missing. What is that? Soap dispenser, I think. Okay. Okay. Is it, is it just? Oh, 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 oh it's starting to come together. Uh, with, with, I, I recognize that symbol. I recognize oh. that symbol. Is it the bottom right one? Um, um, it says, it's a star here. Uh, sigils of the demonic names. I think it's the third one. Um, it's this one right yeah, here. That was the one I was thinking. Okay, that's definitely it. Desolation. Okay, let's uh, let's let's. I'm gonna take a picture of these. I think it's got to be the third one because, I, I mean, I don't know if we want to just guess it. I mean, if it if it's if it's. But it, the third it's, one. It's definitely one of these. The third one is the only one with that H symbol. We have right. the H, the compass, and the one that looks like a J. Okay, so we have um, we have the the thing with the X through it. Yep, yep, that's there. The little V T thing and the H. So the missing one is the Z. If if that's it. And it's the only one of the House of Desolation with the H. So I think it's. Teshak. I think it's Teshak. We could try for it. Let me move. Let me move this here. Can you? What does the middle do anything? Oh, maybe we can't. You know what? It probably makes us like find all the symbols. That way you can't, because that would be too easy to like skip ahead without actually finding the fourth symbol. Should I put this in? No, not yet. Not yet. I'll wait. But I think it's the Z. I think it's Teshak. Yeah. I mean, we could try putting it in, but... Let's, let's finish embalming him first. Okay. <gasps> Someone wants to get out. Or in. Oh! Whoa. This was an empty one. Whoa. Oh, 
tingles, bad tingles, bad tingles. Do the paper. Paper. No, the paper. Oh. Over there. The doors of it the is the Z. It is the Z. I need to place it on him. Do I place it on him? You no. still need to do the embalming. He needs to have the... F oh, he has fill, the fluid. Fill a reservoir bag and then insert it into the... Okay, the bag, the bag. The bag right here. I can't hold anything else. Oh. It's not the bag. Oh, no. Oh, gosh. Dang it. All right, okay. I put it back. Oh, oh, I need to hurry. I need to hurry. Are you looking for the blood bag? It's in the upper left cabinets. Oops. Drop that. Upper left. Chris? Yeah. What do I do? What do I do with it? I forgot. And the trocar, the trocar. Oh. We're going to do the stomach. Oh, I don't like the building. Me neither. Should I just put the mark on him and burn him? Do you know how to do that? No. It's too late, he said. There we go. You could try to put the mark on him and burn him. Mix cleaners. Where's the thing? Well, mix, mix cleaners, cleaners in the bathroom. In the bathroom. Rearrange the symbols. I don't know. Okay. Did they automatically? You can take mark. But like, what is that? That's like once. Yeah, I think we need to like rearrange. Oh, oh. wait. Okay. Yeah. So you can do that. Okay. 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 So the the Z at the top. The, this right here, this here, and the H here. Okay, take mark. Take mark. Okay. Let's put it on him. We have the I mark. can use that here. So go to the body. You're wrong, you know. You're wrong, you know. Are you sure this is the right one? Yeah. I'm still gonna moisturize you. <laughs> you gotta be so moist before right. you go in. Oh. Return the body. No, I don't. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> let, he said, let me in. Hurry. Oh, geez. How do I, how do I get him in the, 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 the flamey thingy? I don't know. Maybe we open it with the key. Nobody likes a dry demon. Oh, 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 he's walking. Oh, he's walking. Are you sure this is the right one? Yes. Get in there. That's not it. How do you open it up? Do I need to put him? Do you need to flip the breaker or something? Oh, move it closer. Oh. Oh. Oh, they we doing the right thing. I don't know. I don't know. It seems like he had the mark. He had the mark. Oh, are we going to get the bad ending? Are we going to get the bad ending? Sounds like 
Something's happening in there. Oh, 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 he's crawling out. You're supposed to die. You're supposed to die. Oh, 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 he got sucked back in. I can't tell if this is good or bad. Crispy Demon. Can we have Cri Can we have Crispy Demon? There he is. Good. Is it over? It's never over. But you survived. What do you mean? Can I leave? I want to go home. You can leave. But once an entity finds you, all the houses of hell will do anything to get back to you. I'm sorry, but it doesn't end here. From now on, there is always a chance this will happen again, no matter where you are. I don't want this. I just want to leave. What do I do? I'm sorry, but there's no going back. I've spent years learning everything I can to keep these entities at bay. It's the only thing we can do. So what, you're waging some selfless holy war? It's not a war, it's survival. And I'd hardly call it selfless. We're caught at the front line of something larger, but I don't do this for some greater good. We either face it or fall to it. Mm -hmm. I wish I could claim to be someone better, suffering hell to save us all. But I simply want to live another day, just like everyone else. When I first experienced this, I had to make a choice. I could run and spend the rest of my days in fear, or I could learn to face it and keep some semblance of a normal life. Normal. Right. It's not a life I would want for anyone, but choosing between a life of fear or control. You're the first person I've met to face this hell and survive. What happened to so others? I'm offering you a different kind of job. Work the night shift. Learn what I know. Give yourself a chance at a life beyond fear. I don't know what you experienced, but I know it uses the worst parts of you against yourself. Mm. The more you experience, the more you'll confront the darkest parts of your Grandma. life. But through it, you'll become unbreakable. I'm offering the tools to take control. The choice is yours. I hope you come back. Oh. Oh. We did it though. We did it. We did it. Chat saying we got the good ending first try. Heck That's yeah. That's pretty dang good. Heck yeah. Also, I saw several yeah. people saying that Heck they'd yeah. never seen that Heck like yeah. alternate reality scene yeah. in the dark place. Uh, so we got ending one of five. We got the good ending, supposedly. Oh. 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 That was oh. Fun, 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 fun. Scary, scary, scary. Scary, scary, <laughs> fun. I like it. Kind of makes me like want to play more scary games. I know. Yeah. I mean, I could play this again too because, like, I think it's different every time. Like, All we right. never, we never yeah. figured out that code. Yeah. We never yeah, went we, down. We never went in, into the basement. Into the basement. I don't know. What is there to find? I don't know. But um, I had a fun time doing it. Yeah, me too. <laughs>